Good morning, church. We have no new blue cards this week. I do have a thank you note that I'd like to read from Doug and Sylvia McDaniel. Dear Dustin, Church of Christ family, little did we know that when we chose your congregation to worship with the month of November, we would be blessed so richly. I reached out to you in our hours of distress just to ask for prayers, and you totally overwhelmed us with your texts, your prayers, your donations, and even your visits to the hospital and our hotel. You've been angels on earth to us. We are more thankful than you'll ever know. God bless each and every one of you twice over. Doug and Sylvia McDaniel. Hopefully Doug will be going home this week uh, before Christmas. A quick update on Tommy Carter. Uh, last night his fever reached 104 and then broke. Uh, and so he was much better this morning and complaining that he was ready to go home. So hopefully Gene will make him some cookies and all will be, all will be good. <laughs> if you would stand. We'll have a prayer, then Chip will close us in song. Will you pray with me? Dear God, our Father in heaven, we thank you for this opportunity we have to come to worship together, to worship you, to sing praises to you, to, to glorify your name and to fill your spirit among us, Father. We're, we're so thankful for the McDaniels, uh, for the success that they had with their doctors, for, for uh, you, you laying your hand on him and healing him. Father, we pray that healing continues. And, and Father, I personally am so thankful for this family here that knows the true spirit of Christmas and has that true spirit all year round, Father, to share that joy that Gary talked about with those around us who, who need to feel that joy. And Father, we're, we're so thankful for the opportunity we have to come to you in prayer on behalf of those like the McDaniels and Tommy Carter, and Jennifer Bailey, and Jessica Moore, and the Kessler family, for Margie Ingram. For all those that we, we lift up to you every day, Father, we pray that you will continue to bless them. You'll continue to give them strength. You'll continue to, to be with them in their challenges, uh, and, and just, just bless them, and, and just continue to hear our prayers. Father, we're, we're so mindful of all those around us in this holiday season that are less fortunate than us. And Father, we pray that you'll continue to help us to, to bless them and bring joy to them. Father, we pray that you'll be with all of us who will be traveling over the coming weeks and that you'll keep us safe and you will bring us back at the end of our travels. We pray this prayer in Jesus' most holy name. Amen. <laughs> 